Hey, Chameleon.com here. Today, I have one of the best, most affordable, and universal solutions for whatever seat you're trying to heat. Which brings me to today's sponsor, SoJoy, which in my opinion is one of the top manufacturers of heated car seats and other accessories, mainly the heated car seat category um, on Amazon and other marketplaces. Not just according to what I say, but according to the ratings on some of their products. I actually just did a review on one of their top selling, pretty much their most reviewed product, which is their universal seat cushion, which is, uh, if I can just pull it up right here, this guy, I just did a review on this one at the time of this recording. It was Amazon choice, 772 customer reviews at four stars. And now I'm going to be reviewing and unbagging this one, which is actually a little bit more affordable, a little bit cheaper at the time of this recording, and uh, still universal, and I'm just going to unbag it and give you my honest impressions. Let's do this thing. While I'm doing that, check us out in the links in the description below. We are going to have links to not only SoJoy's full line of products, but to heated car seats in general to make sure that you get the best price on whatever heated car seat or whatever automotive accessory you choose today. And be sure to check us out over at chameleon.com because not only do we have car stuff and accessories like heated car seats, seat covers, leather car seats, stuff for your pet, your dog, just a ton of different stuff, even air filters. If it goes on or in a car, we have it over at chameleon.com, including SoJoy heated seat covers. And by the way, while I'm talking about SoJoy, their website, they have a ton of heated car stuff. They even have like little wedges where it's not even the full seat. They have different designs like this one here. They have heated blankets, which I'm about to make a review of as well. And even cushions for pretty much anything. So let's get straight into this review and let me talk about what this thing does. It's got a 45 minute heating timing function. Trigger starts once, it starts working again. Sufficient hand control wires to ensure that the main and passenger seats are available. And the maximum heating temperature apparently is up to 118 degrees Fahrenheit. Things are gonna be getting hot in that car. Or pleasantly warm. However, however hot you wanna get it is what I'm getting at, is this thing can do it. So, one thing I will mention is that as opposed to the other universal car seat I just did a review of, this one I think only has two uh, selectors. It's got a different selector switch in general. So not saying it's... Also, I will say this. The material itself, it does not have the same um, smell as the other one did. This one seems a bit more like felt. The other one was a bit more like uh, kind of like a plastic material. This one's more, I would say, rigid. Let me take a look here. Oop, got that. Okay, and I am going to sit on this thing and test the comfort. Came with an instruction manual, which I'll go through by the end of this video. And once again, guys, if I haven't mentioned it already, be sure to like, subscribe, and ring that bell for more content in the future for automotive stuff and accessories. And check out our other SoJoy videos. So let me check this out really quick. It's got a nice length cord on it. I would say it's about... Probably about the same as the other one, about five and a half, maybe six feet long. So you got a lot of room here. Probably even plug this into the back seat if you even wanted to in a car. I like the idea of using these in an office chair. Like if you're in like a campground or something and it's not a heated office, you could probably just put this on a uh, on an office seat. I'm plugging this in off camera to a 12 volt DC. Okay. Okay. Now. Good thing that's a portable. There we go. I got it. So this is high. That's low. Unlike the other one, I will say this. This one's a little bit more affordable. I'm not saying it's a bad one, but the other one seemed to have a little bit more features to it. Like it had low, medium, high, and um, this is just a simple click device. The other one was a push button. I'm going to keep this on just so I can test the heat. I'm going to put it on high. And I'm going to do a quick flip through the manual. But while I do, I'm going to read off the Amazon listings. So, maximum heat temperature, universal fit, 12 volts DCs for most cars, trucks, RVs, and boats. Time off function, no need to unplug the power supply when leaving the car. 
more safe and reliable. Fuse is a five amp, I think. Super, I'm reading off the listing. Super soft velvet. I will say that the velvet on this, I actually have the other one right here that I just reviewed. It is definitely, uh, I don't know if I would say softer, but compare the two of these. That's interesting. Huh. Hmm. Okay. Super soft fel fel velvet fabric composite foam polyurethane is very... Very comfortable to touch to the skin in winter. The two hooks of the seat are fixed for easy access, a buckle strap at the waist, a loose socket at the top, and a tightly mounted seat. The back equipped with silicone anti-slip effect for safer driving. So you just go right here, clips on and off, goes right over the uh, headrest of your car, clips in, and you're good to go. Pretty sweet. And they also have them on the butt and the waist, as you can see here. And then they also have uh, what is made of, that kind of thing. And it's also got this nice dotted uh, undercarriage of the seat, so it really grips. Like, you got a nice grippy surface. The back does not have the grippy, but it does have a nice felt on the back. You know, even though this one's a little bit cheaper than the other Universal one, I gotta tell you, I wouldn't say it's like... I don't know, man. This might be a little bit more comfortable than the other one. So, you know, if you want, like, everyone's different. If you want a flip switch for whatever reason, if you want, like, a toggle switch as opposed to a, um, as opposed to a push-button model, like, the uh, the uh, more rated one has this push-button model, whatever you're trying to go with with the car, either one of these is one of the top easiest solutions for a car. You don't have to cut open the seat or um, go underneath the actual insulation of the seat to reinstall, but if you do happen to have one of those cars that you do want to do that. I did a review. The first review I did for So Joy was for their um, Retrofit series. And I did it for the felt, and I'm about to do it for the carbon fiber. But the reason I like these is that not only are the cables, they seem to be good quality, but they have they the, the, the output for the cords, they have like every type of output, even like all the way to like bare wire. They have like these hook designs. They have different types of plugins. So whatever car you have, I think Foreigner Domestic, if you have a retrofit series, they also make these uh, ones that plug right in, which is great if you don't want to put it over your seat. Just thought I'd mention that. We will also have links in the description to our channel if you want to watch our other SoJoy reviews. Not much else I can really say about it. I think I'll read off a couple of uh, Amazon reviews for it. This is full five stars. It's only got six ratings, but no one has sent said anything bad about it great soft and heated seat cushion quick heat and comfortable couldn't ask for anything better good for this price useful during the cold season and great product i'm gonna keep the review real i do know that this is sponsored by sojoy but the one benefit that i would like to say to this is that because of the material and that it's uh a velvet as opposed to i think the other one was like polyurethane was i wrong let me check. The other one was made of like... I don't know what it was. It was a type of... Oh, it's a thick polyester fabric. I think that's what did it. It just had a... I'm not saying... It doesn't... I'm going to use it anyway in my van. I don't care. I'm just going to rinse it off with some, you know, soap and water. But it has a, it had a little bit of a... A little bit of a smell to it. But nothing some soap and water can't fix. I just thought I'd mention that this one does not have as much of a smell given this the felt the velvet um, material. So I just thought I'd mention that. Either one's fine. The one before it is more rated. I think it actually has a more high quality timer to it. There's trade offs for both. The other one's a little bit cheaper, a little bit more affordable than this option. This one seems to have a better uh, clicker switch than this one because this is an up or down. You can't go wrong either way. They're both awesome heaters. So what can else can I say about these things? They heat your seat, they heat your butt, they heat your back, they heat your car. They make your ride more comfortable, and they can heat things up wherever you need some heat. So on that note, I think we're going to end off the review on that. I like it a lot. The heat, pretty good. I can feel it just from the small amount of time I had it on. And then I'll sit on it like I did the other one, just for the sake of the video. And I'll let you know my honest opinion on it. It's, um, it's uh, actually, well, that's pretty good. 
The reason I like these is that they're not they're not crazy thick. Like you can still feel the underside of whatever's there, but it's good because it's not too thick to where you can put it over a seat. That's why I like that they didn't make the cushioning too thick, which is great. It's a good idea not to make it too thick because you want to be able to drive comfortably too. So I think that's all I really have to say about this thing. I think I'll read off one Amazon review before I go. I want to get one um, one other opinion. I bought this for myself to prepare for this coming winter. The heated seat cushion is soft and comfortable to sit on. I love that it heats up fast when I try to use it. The convenient to use of the remote controller, the safety feature that it shuts off after it's been running continuously for 45 minutes, so you don't need to worry about when you forget to turn it off. Overall, I can say that it's useful and good quality. Heated seat cushion for the price. I'm happy with my purchase on Amazon again. All right. You know, same thing. Five star. They like that it turns off. Um, this guy says it takes a little bit of time to warm. It takes like not even 30 seconds to a minute. Two heat levels. Um... I would like to mention this. This guy says he's had other brands, but some don't have the auto auto shut off and have killed several batteries. That was my concern. That's why I'm happy they made this. If you had if you had a heated car seat company that doesn't have an auto shut off and your battery dies, well that that's not going to be very good. So I like that they incorporated that into the design. Pretty awesome. All right, on that note, guys, I think I'm going to leave it. Uh, I recommend it. Seems to be a pretty good product to me. You know, pretty good safety features as far as everything's concerned. They have a good instruction manual. Very into customer service over there at SoJoy. I think they'll even ship global. They have USA-based support here if you're looking for support. The installation is extremely easy. Couple, if you can buckle a, uh, if you can buckle a belt, you can install this in your car. All you have to do is throw it over the seat, and you're good to go. Good instruction manual. Good customer service. Good Amazon ratings. Not too much bad stuff i can say about this thing it's good stuff all right on that note guys as always chameleon.com is out links will be in the description below to buy your heated seat car solution today and on that note we are out be sure to ring that bell like and subscribe for more of our videos peace